Hi everyone, it's the English Simmer here and I feel like I'm getting sadder and sadder every time I start one of these videos because I'm so scared that our first generation of our Nightmare Legacy Challenge, aka our short lifespan legacy, is gonna pass away at any given moment. Today might be the day that we say goodbye to DeAndre, either this part or the next part. I'm putting a fiver down on it. Place your bets. When do you think DeAndre is gonna pass away? We do already, of course, have the life extender potion. Um, so at least we know we can do that. But I got this notification that said, it's almost DeAndre's time. Make the most of these final days. And I also got one for Hillary, who's actually older than DeAndre. This said, Hilary Laurent's life is coming to an end. This would be a good time to get her affairs in order. I don't want to go over to the goth household. I am currently trying to have Bryce listen in on the, I think it was a military person or a scientist. One of the two, a person in a lab coat that definitely worked at Strangerville Labs. Okay, calm down, shaky hands. <laughs> Does anyone else have like ridiculously shaky hands? I I swear, whenever I take like a photo or anything, like if I take a video, I shake so much, which is not great for the job that I do. Ooh, did we get anything? I think we got a piece of evidence. That thing in the lab, the whole town is in danger. Bryce received Strangeville evidence, top secret audio recording. We're gonna actually purchase two more bugs. I am kind of scared to leave the lot. I'm not gonna lie. I'm just scared because I'm scared Hillary is gonna like pass away at any given moment. She's currently lagging, which is super fun. <gasps> oh, I thought that that meant she was gonna die. Why would you do that to me? A dog was adopted by the Langrab safe file house. Yeah, I know, Cinnamon, we met her. Work for DeAndre starts in an hour. Oh, DeAndre got a promotion, by the way. He is a level nine in his career. He has to max fitness, but it's really tough as an elder because he keeps getting like dangerously tired, as does Hillary. Um, I got them this little like sparring partner thing. I'm actually, I'm gonna bring Hillary with us, I think. Oh, but if she starts to die, then that's it. Like, she can't take the potion. I'm fairly sure. Okay, hear me out on this one. I think if one of our parents starts to die, because it says that we're allowed to use the lifespan potion at least once. Well, once as we're doing like the nightmare challenge of this challenge. We're allowed to use it once when they hit an elder. So it's kind of what to me when I use that. Hillary, I did say was my guinea pig. Um, she has had probably like about three days out of it since she got that notification, which makes me feel like we could potentially get a promotion, but we're gonna go to the secret lab. We're gonna bring our mum with us just in case. And we're also, you know what? We're gonna bring Erwin with us and I feel like we have to bring Jace. I feel like Jace is in it for the long haul now. He's our big bro. Okay, all the evidence piles have respawned. Oh, this is really, really helpful for us. Hillary, why don't you just like go here, bestie? Just like go chill out. I also feel like we need to get our hands on a laptop. I know we bought a hearing device, but considering we're probably gonna have to hack into these, we need a programming skill of three or higher. Ooh, Erwin. I kinda wanna plant a bug on Erwin, but I feel bad if I do that. <gasps> okay, we should have the dossier literally ready and waiting for us after we've got this last piece of of evidence. There we go. We got our 15 pieces. Let's compile the secret dossier. And there we go. This can be used to obtain a key card for the secret lab. Check the curio shop owner's secret inventory or ask scientists or military personnel. Ugh, no, she's my guinea pig. I'm not gonna give in. Not just yet. I feel harsh, but not just yet. Hillary, we're going out with a bang, girly. <laughs> We're going to Eight Bells, the bar of Strangeville, which definitely isn't the coolest place. Honestly, I don't think it's particularly where I would want to spend my last day on Earth, like a 
American back town in the middle of nowhere. Although it is pretty sick. Like I said, this does always remind me of Winona Earp. Erwin, I'm gonna need that secret inventory of yours, dude. And 250 simoleons are all yours. Bryce just obtained the key card. It should grant access to any door in the secret lab. <gasps> Heck yeah. Okay, you need the loo. Every new interaction that she gets, I'm like, is this it? Is this the moment? <laughs> How is your bladder still going up and yet you're here? I'm so confused. Were you just pissing in your trousers? Is that what was happening? You're getting far too comfortable, Bryce. I know you're in the middle of nowhere and you don't really know people around here, but you cannot be doing that. Does she have more of a chance of dying if we're with her? Like if she's on our lot, will the game still kill her off? Probably. I will say, Strangerville is very like to and fro. Like you've kind of got to be here, there and everywhere, but it is definitely fun. It's definitely one of my favorite packs for The Sims 4. Like, yeah, it doesn't have like too much replayability for me, unless it's like this and like the story is calling to me like for a specific Sim, which it very much could do. Like I think if, I think this is a very interesting start to a legacy. I feel like you're kind of like, like learning about like the Sims world that they live in and stuff. <gasps> we got the spores. Collect 15 spore clusters. Assemble a hazmat suit. How do we collect the spores? I forgot. Oh, find an infection scanner by questioning military personnel. Once you have this in your inventory, scan the ground to reveal spore clusters. Traverse into the deepest part of the secret lab. We can't do that unless we have, don't go in. I stupidly sent her in there. She's gonna start coughing her guts up. You cannot go in there. How does that not give you a moodlet? <gasps> oh no. Oh no! Bryce! Oh no, she's possessed. Do you see those eyes? <gasps> Do you see what I see? Oh no. Oh no, she's so possessed. The eyes, they're so creepy. Oh, Bryce, what have I done to you? Look at her. Oh my word, how long is she possessed for? Oh, only like 16 minutes. Look at the way she's walking as well. Oh, it's so creepy. She looks like a little ragdoll. Plant a bizarre plant. Wait, she just like has that in her inventory from being possessed? Whoa, she does. You can tell that I've not played this for a while. That's really cool. Okay, she is no longer possessed. Thank goodness that did not last long. Oh, I kind of wish that she had planted that like on her home lot. <gasps> Wait, we can nurture this one. We can taunt it. Let's collect a microscopic sample. They're so big, we got to the next portion of Strangerville. Oh no, look at the clouds. There's like a crater of clouds above us as well. <gasps> Let's try and nurture. So this is our special friend. This is the one that we're gonna try and like take a bizarre fruit from. Harvest bizarre fruit, hell yeah, give me that plump ball. Thank you very, very much, okay. We've got one. A slide sample has been added to Bryce's inventory. <gasps> Strangerville, I feckin' love you. The bloom begins. Leaving the secret lab, you can't help but notice the sky has shifted to an airy color. Something has changed in Strangerville and not for the better. Opening that lab door must have released some kind of toxin into the air. You'll need to find a way to protect yourself from the toxic spores in the secret lab. Try talking to people around town to see if they know of anything that might help. Right, we need to talk to military personnel. So we're gonna question about those spores in the lab. It's guys night. Gentlemen Sims can saunter on up. Ugh, no thank you. Crystal, do you wanna give me uh, give me the spore cluster thing that I need? That would be great. I just got this new infection scanner. It's really cool. I, it can, I, I mean, that's classified information, but if you can convince me, maybe I can give you one. Okay, we're gonna give you a funny intro 
introduction. Be my friend, bestie. We can try and impress for infection scanner. We can also bribe for 750. Check out my muscles. Is she just gonna give them? Oh my God, that's the gayest shit I've ever seen. We were like, oh my God, check out my muscles. Wait, is she not gonna give it to me? I thought she was gonna do it. Pull rank, we don't have, we're not a level five. We're a teenager, goddammit. Convinced to give infection scanner. Oh, we're gonna have to bribe her. Right, Bryce, she's seen your muscles. Wait, what, well, that was impressing her? Should I not have, she was like, look at my muscles. Look at how many press ups I can do. She's a soldier. My athleticism is definitely gonna impress her. I don't know what you mean. Judith, please piss off. I really don't care about you. You've got to be joking. You think that's impressive? You're gonna have to get stronger if you're gonna impress me. <gasps> I really shouldn't, but whatever the government has, tons, here you go. She just gave us one? We literally just had to pay 750? Sweet. Sorry, Deandre. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Oh, she's stretching, okay. The, I am terrified, I swear. I should just down the drink so that I can stop worrying. But I wanna see what a short lifespan, cause it felt really short in my cottage living. So I really do think that Hillary could go at any time. I've looked at her age and she has this, which obviously means like aging up. If you've still got another growth stage to go. However, she doesn't have another growth stage to go. I think Benjamin is pretty cute. Yeah, romance is in the air. I don't think she can die at work. So I'm gonna hold off actually. I was gonna give her her thing. We're gonna have her work hard. I need to age up Bianca. Yesterday was Bianca's birthday. And for some reason she didn't get like the, I'm sad you missed my birthday. Like she just didn't wanna age up apparently. And this means that DeAndre is kind of just left to himself. Oh, it's like the good old days, buddy. We can just like relax and chill. Like all the kids have gone to school. Last day that the kids will be able to go to school. Well, at least for Bianca, cause Bianca's gonna age up. Bryce doesn't age up for at least another few days, I think. Yeah, Bryce has like four days. So I don't think she's gonna be the youngest person to ever complete Strangerville, considering I don't actually think that we'll do the whole thing in four days. It actually does take a fair while, but sir, you are actually going to. So what do we need to do? We need to definitely work on your fitness skill. Our little money tree has started to grow, but like it's kind of still not great. You know what? I might actually have him take a brisk shower so that he can be energized. Ooh, we got bills to pay. 410 simoleons, absolutely a-okay. Um, You are actually gonna study hard. Kind of don't want her to make friends anymore. I feel like she's got enough friends. She's got the League of Adventurers. Who else does she need? <gasps> Who's calling? A phone to pick. Bianca was discovered playing games on her phone. Uh, she already has that might. Yep. Yeah. I knew that that was gonna take her out of the range to earn the responsible trait. Right, you're gonna push it to the limits. Push it, push it to the limit, limits. God, he's almost dead and I'm only just figuring out his traits. Wait, what are his traits again? Romantic, genius, and geek. I mean, it kind of worked out well that he did roll to be an astronaut. Bryce's latest classroom assignment is a group project. Oh yeah, she would definitely contribute. She got a performance gain small. She would absolutely do that. Okay, nice. Now we're feeling energized. Oh, he has the dangerously tired. I hate being an elder. He's never gonna get his skill up to level freaking 10 if he keeps having to rest for like four hours in between every every single workout. Oh no, no, it's telling me that DeAndre's life is coming to an end. How? He's barely even begun his life. This is not okay. Look, he doesn't have the aging up one yet though. I still think he's okay. Let's discuss fitness techniques and Brighton Mortimer's day. I decided to bring the boys about so that he could socialize a little bit. Show off your muscles. He is a lean man, to be fair. He's a lean, mean fighting machine. I should have planted this earlier. Why did I not think to do the money tree earlier? He is absolutely 
absolutely. Even with a money tree, how much did we need to get for his little lifetime aspiration? Have earned 200,000. That is so much money. Morty is in an angry mood. I'm gonna go talk to my baby Malcolm. He would never hurt me the way that you just did. Mortimer. I love their little boys club and the fact I should have aged these two up into elders to be fair but I just love how, how they still just like get together and just chat about life and stuff. It is the cutest thing. Why did I keep our mailbox all the way over there this entire time? You would have thought after 10 parts I would have moved that to be like closer to our door. Didn't even think about it. Bryce was apparently sent home with a school project. Oh but it's a robotics one. I actually feel like she'd be into that. I annoyingly like wasn't gonna do it, but we are- no, 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 no! Don't eat that bizarre fruit. Put that back in your inventory. Don't eat it. Oh my god, I want you to plant it. <gasps> that was so close. Good job I freaking noticed that. Get over here and plant it. Holy smokes. I would have been so mad if she had eaten that. Bianca, stop standing near my plant. Leave it alone. This is my school project. Oh, what's this one? <gasps> this is the growth pod. Um, DeAndre actually got this from a space mission. So he has like an unidentified fruit object, which is really, really cool. But yeah, instead of doing her work, she's gonna go back to the lab. See, this is why I like Strangerville. All right, let's try and scan the area. Maybe we can just do this like literally around around Strangerville. No, there we go. We're gonna put these ones in our inventory. Oh, we can do it in these places. We just can't go to the deepest depths. Okay, you scanned. Oh wait, there's loads. There's like five in here. Okay, we're gonna put all of these bad boys in our inventory. Thank you very much. All right, we got five out of 15. Hopefully, oh, we can just scan here. Nice. Let's get all these little clusters and then we'll go and scan over here as well. And this should give us the 15 that we need. What's this? Requires 15 spore clusters. Okay, okay. Should I do that? I feel like they're probably gonna wanna see it, but also I kinda don't wanna waste my spores. Maybe we should go talk to someone before I do it so that I know that I'm not wasting them. Where's my bestie? Bo, hell yeah. Bo just gives up information. Bo, I don't think appreciated working for the government. <laughs> he was like, oh, you're trying to keep this under wraps? Oh, okay, you killed all of my scientist friends? Yeah, I'm gonna stab you in the back, which you know what, fair and valid. If I got screwed over by my employer, I would also wanna like absolutely say screw them. I have the materials to craft a spore filter, but I've not been able to analyze enough spore clusters. Use the chemical analyzer at the secret lab to in- Oh, okay, so we should have just done that from the bloody get-go. I knew it wouldn't have been bloody wasted. Go on, Bryce, you can do it. It makes me really proud that she's only a teen and she's doing all of this. Like, she's literally doing the research that these scientists, like, failed to do. Don't let them distract you. Bryce, get going. Get to work. Oi, Bo, stop trying to distract her just because you couldn't do your job. I like how I was literally just protecting him like yeah you know what it's the government's fault and now I'm like screw you I could honestly turn on a dime as long as you aren't my sim my own sims I will protect with my life you sir do not bring that mustache anywhere near me my father used to have the same one until I told him to shave it off you told me to do it and then we don't even have a high enough relationship why would you trick me like that also stranger danger I'm a loner I don't like this I don't like like talking to people. Oh my god, okay. No, go ask her. I know you're gonna piss your pants. <gasps> okay, he brought home some money. How close is he to a promotion? Oh, he still has the dangerously tired. He just needs to get to a fitness level 10. Wow, you did it. Let me analyze this infection profile data and I'll send you a spore filter in the mail soon. Keep digging and you might find a vaccine for this infection after all. I think quickly before we turn in for the night, I'm just gonna see if Erwin also has something to say. So let's question
question him about the spores in the lab because he might be able to give us like the second bit of this thing that we need. I have a couple of hazmat suits in my secret inventory. I doubt they'll do much good without a spore filter, but I'd be willing to sell it to you if you're interested. Absolutely. A thousand simoleons. My parents have that money. <laughs> Enjoy your brand new incomplete hazmat suit. I told you it was missing a crucial component. You might want to question scientists about spores. They might be able to provide some kind of spore filter. Okay, nice. We're definitely being sent that in the post. I love, to be fair, I don't think that her parents would mind that she was using like all of their money for Strangeville. Like they're obviously super interested in space and like aliens and like they are, I mean, astronauts are like scientists of space, are they not? I don't think NASA would have an issue with me saying that. <gasps> Look at his little outfit. Oh my God, sir. You look so suave in your little fit. Absolutely feckin' love it, you little cutie. You know what? This is risky business. So I'm gonna have her drink this and see how it actually affects her age. It's probably only gonna roll her back like a tiny... <gasps> it rolled her back the full way? Oh, that's quite good. Okay, so I took that on Tuesday. Mm, early morning. Maybe I shouldn't have waited till like the day, but that's very handy to know. Maybe we will get his lifetime aspiration done. Holy smokes, Hillary, I love you. I should probably age her up. I don't know why she's not aging up. It's really weird. Like she's not got like the forgot about my birthday which is like the first time that this has happened. He got another unidentified fruit object, which honestly, I'm just gonna sell. And I'm also gonna sell the cow plant berry. Uh, can you actually box really, really quickly? But yeah, he is gonna, uh, he now has it too. To be fair, she had it for like a solid day. So I think we don't have to feed him the drink yet, hopefully. Fingers crossed he's not just gonna pass out after he does this. Pass out forever. I swear, Bianca knows that she's not the heir. She keeps trying to sabotage us. Bryce is just out here like trying to do her homework and stuff. And Bianca's just like, I'm just gonna talk to you for like ever. <laughs> I'm never gonna let you get as good enough grades as me. Even though you're the heir and Molly loves you, I'm gonna make sure that I'm the favorite child with my parents. Bianca, you've never been the favorite child. They left you to die in a fire. <laughs> That sounds so harsh for me to say, but it's actually accurate. To be fair, DeAndre did save her, but like he did it very, very reluctantly. He just wanted to make sure that Bryce was okay. It really was written in the stars. And I mean that quite literally as they are both astronauts, that Bryce was always gonna be the favorite child. But I'm gonna wrap it up here. I am hopefully gonna get back to you when he is ready for a feckin' promotion. We need it. Thank you all so much for tuning in though. I hope you're enjoying Strangerville. We are gonna probably take a little break from it just while she's waiting the next couple of days for that thing to arrive. Honestly, it might have already arrived because we do have mail. Um, but yeah, probably gonna be a little bit low key. I don't think I'm gonna do every step. I kind of want to though, because I've got had a lot of comments from you lot saying like, I've never played Strangerville. Like I've never really explored it for myself. I don't have the pack. Like I'm really excited to see you play it. So maybe I will record everything. Let me know. Do you want me to like skip over some things? I guess when it's like repeated, like collecting the evidence, we won't do it. Ooh, complete a hundred whims over all Sims. Nice. But yeah. Let me know how you feel about that. Thank you all so much for tuning in and I will speak to you all in my next part. Bye now.